What's going on, gaming nerds? Welcome back to Midnight Gaming with Mystic Nightmare. Glad you guys decided to come to the channel and hang out today. Hope you guys are having a fantastic day. I'm having a pretty decent day. As always, if you like the video, hit the like button. If you don't like it, don't hit it. And no matter what you do, just subscribe. And uh, as you can see, it's midnight. We are back on the long dark. And ladies and gentlemen, it is hunting season. That's right. I've decided, you know what? I'm going to go ahead and follow my own advice and look around for a bunch of wolves. Uh, but basic... Okay, I'm hearing funny noises. Alright, so I'm going to follow my own adv advice. We still need to make the deerskin pants. We still need to make... Um, well, yeah, we still need to make the, uh, the rabbit hide gloves, I believe. And basically what it comes down to is when we decide to leave this place and go to the next area, which I believe the next area is... I don't even remember. It starts with a D. I can't remember it. The na remember the name of it. But um, basically, we need to make sure that we repair all of our gear before we go. And we actually have... Let's see, we have one wolf skin uh, hide back at the Quonset here. We need two more deerskin hides for the, um, to make the pants, I believe is what it was. And then we also need one more deerskin hide to repair the pants before we go and one more deerskin hide to repair the boots before we go because right now what we're looking at is uh it's, we're down to 83 percent on our wolf skin coat and it's a 10 it used to be at 12 now it's at 10.4 and 7.4 and we're at 83 percent on our boots they went from 7.4 and 5.4 I believe down to these numbers right here um, so it's not I mean it's not like we need to do it immediately but we do need to do it uh, and we need to get some hide and we might as well get some meat too uh, I know that this over here is where I ran a deer into a uh, into a wolf So let's just go ahead and harvest this. Is it cold? Uh, yeah, we're a little bit cold right now. It'd probably be a good idea if I had... Let's see. Oh, 14 pounds. Wow, really? We need a couple... We need the hide, and we need a couple more guts just in case. Wow, three hours? Now, I think it's frozen. Yeah, see how it says harvest frozen carcass? If you switch to an axe, it, it lowers it. So, that's two hours. It's kind of cold out here right now. No, it still says it's kind of warm now. Yeah, three hours, three hours, three hours. That's a lot of meat, and that's a lot of deer hide. Um, there's something else that I actually wanted to do as well. I want to go over to Jackrabbit Island. Uh, you would be coming over here, wouldn't you, homie? We don't really need wolf, though. Um... I kind of want to hold, head over to Jackrabbit Island so we can start catching some... Is that Jackrabbit Island or is that... I don't remember which one's Jackrabbit Island! Oh, he's going to come over here and I'm going to have to shoot him, aren't I? Maybe it's down here, this Jackrabbit Island. I don't remember. There's two islands that are out here. And I'm, I can't remember which one is which. Anyway, we also need to do four rabbit skin, uh, rabbit skins to make the rabbit skin gloves. And we also need to do probably an extra one, an extra rabbit, just so we can repair it before we leave. Um, but, but like I've said before, we definitely need to start harvesting and hunt, well, hunting, harvesting, and curing this stuff before, you know, before it gets to we we get too far in this area wow i'm having a hard time talking to, tonight guys 
before we get too far into this you know this this area and then we have to do what we did in mystery lake which is basically wait uh, for this stuff to cure before we leave I want to be able to get that stuff cured and get it made or repaired just just before we leave so I believe this is Jackrabbit Island I'm gonna go over here and what I this what I was thinking about doing was I was actually thinking about taking a couple of like four snares and doing four snares and then just waiting overnight because you have to wait overnight basically and seeing how many rabbits we get but I think what I'm gonna do instead is I'm gonna do two snares and I'm gonna do some bow hunting I'm gonna try to do some bow hunting and you know what these deer are out here now so I might as well just I don't think I can hit him from this far away this one stopped let's hope I can hit him from here no don't start what okay fine Oh man, this distance. I suck at shooting. I have a real hard time not just pulling out the gun and just start unloading some rounds over there. <laughs> I'm used to being able to do that in hunting games. Oh, you guys are going to stop? Okay. Alright, let's see if we can get one of these. Oh, are you kidding me? Probably should have aimed for the head. There is actual headshots in this game, so if you aim for the head and you hit the head, you're probably going to drop them. Or is this Jackrabbit Island over here? Is that Jackrabbit Island? No, I don't think that's Jackrabbit Island. I think this is Jackrabbit Island over here. So we need to go this way anyway. Too far. Come on. Let's try this again. There we go. There we go. Mystic sucks, but he doesn't suck that bad. <laughs> Alright. So since this is a brand new kill, he should be able to be a quick harvest. I really don't have the weight for it. I, in fact, oh, he's 20 pounds? Good lord. He's a big boy. I, I definitely want all this meat. Um... Oh, I just used the hatchet. You idiot, Mystic. Okay, so we're okay. We're a little bit thirsty now. Let's check to make sure there's no wolves around. And we're up to 87 pounds already. That's ridiculous. Oh, well. It's got to be done. Now let's go ahead and set up... I'm going to go over to Jackrabbit Island. I'll probably be right back. Um, let's go ahead and set up our snares. And then... Seriously? Okay, guys, welcome back. We are over at Jackrabbit Island. And I guess I'm not as bad a shot as I thought I was. There's actually a deer right out there that was on its way over here. Uh, we must have shot it. I must have hit it. And then it ran off and it died later on. Uh, it was like 1... It was like 1%. It was only like 1% frozen. So that's pretty good. Um, I'm trying to find some jackrabbits right now because I need to place uh, where is our snares I need to place our snare down and basically like I said before with snares it comes down to you find where the rabbits are going where their trails are and, and they used to have little footprints and stuff. I think there was one that just came up here, wasn't there? I'm thinking about putting one right here. But, um, yeah, you find... There used to be little footprints of where they were. And there... Okay, so there's where one was right there. So we're, I'm going to place it up in here. But they don't have the footprints anymore. Um, and that makes it very hard to, play, to figure out where, where they're going. So you have to actually find... Invalid location, but that's right where a rabbit was. So I'll just place it right here. So yeah, you have to actually watch where they run or where they walk 
and then place it where they're going to be. So there's one down here. Actually, you know what? Mm, I was going to shoot him, but he ran off. So let's place this one. Okay, did I not just say place? So I think he was down here. So I'll give this a try. Like right here. This probably isn't going to be a good spot, honestly. I should have had more snares made. I should have made more. more. Uh, okay, so we got one there. And then we've got one up here. There's another rabbit up there. Man, they're everywhere over here. I want to I want to see if we can do some some rabbit hunting, but they are so hard to get close to unless you're crouching and then crouching is just super 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 slow. That's really dumb that they don't have the actual footprints anymore. I wonder if we could just put it right outside the door here. Because I'm actually planning on going inside the cabin and cooking some meat and eating the meat because we are like over 100 pounds now with meat on it. Okay, so I'm going to get down. I'm going to crouch, stand up. I'm going to keep the tree between us and crouch. And I've never actually... Oh, you know, he's stuck? Seriously? Maybe that's what I need to do. I need to go get that other snare, I bet, and put it down in here. See? And they just run off. It's like impossible to freaking... Look at that. To shoot him with a bow. Unless they end up running on you, I guess. Look at that. As soon as you pull back, they're they're gone. Wait, I need to see the little dot. Oh. Well, if he'd walked a little bit to the left, I think that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to go get the other snare and I'm going to put it down here because obviously there's a lot of them down here. I'm going to put it down here and see if I can go ahead and get these guys... Okay guys, welcome back. Uh, I've gone ahead and stayed the night. I went ahead and started a fire and cooked all of that meat. And I went ahead and rummaged this house. There's a whole bunch of crackers. They love crackers in this house. Which I guess that's fine by me. Uh, peanut butter, some pinnacle peaches. Uh, I found rabbit in the oven. And it's cooked. And I also found a raw trout in the fridge. So not too bad. There is one thing that I just, I'm trying out is I left some raw. I didn't cook uh, some of the meat. I also cooked some of the meat. And I left it outside except for one piece of the raw, which is now at 83%. I actually had one piece of the cooked, but I accidentally ate it, not thinking that I was trying to compare leaving food outside in the cold versus leaving versus keeping it in your inventory or bringing it inside. I know for a fact that if you put it in the fridge, I think if the fridge is eh, maybe it's not. I'm not even going to say it. I was going to say I know for a fact that the fridge will keep it warm but I or cold, but I don't think there's any power to it. So anyway, uh when I put this stuff down, it was eight. It was at eighty. It was at eighty-nine percent. By keeping it in my inventory and sleeping for seven hours, this piece is eighty-three percent, and this piece is eighty-eight percent. The wolf cooked was one hundred when I put it down. Was one hundred percent when I put it down. It's still one hundred percent now. Picking it up even after seven hours. So it looks like the best thing you can do is actually cook all of your meats and then put them outside because after seven hours this is still at a hundred percent. So now that I've tested that out I know that I'll be cooking all of it from now on and I'll be putting it outside. And that idea that I got was from Scoobs. So thank you very much Scoobs. Appreciate that. 
And now I'm going to go put it all back down because it's too freaking heavy for me to carry and I need to go check the traps. Put it all down. I'll even put the raw fish down and that. Yeah, we're going to put all that down. Look at all that food right there. That's ridiculous. Okay, so where did I put... Uh, where am I? That's what I'm wondering. Okay, did I put it... Uh, I, can't, I can't remember where I put our snares! Were they over here, or were they... When the heck did I put our snares? Alright, we got a rabbit in both of them. Look at that. Awesome. Awesome. I'm going to take the meat. This is going to be... I'm going to take the guts. I think after I get... After I... Har ooh, 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 it's cold. It's cold. After I harvest these guys, I'm going to go ahead and uh, stop taking guts because I don't think we really need them after this. So that wasn't too bad. That was actually pretty easy to do. Not a big deal. Looks like we're cold, so I might as well just go back inside. Is the snare broken? Looks like that was a perfect spot to put it, too. Seriously? Oh! That was close! Oh! Oh man, I suck at this! Oh, jeez. And I'm out of arrows. Damn it! Okay, so I'm definitely going to put these these snares down here after I pick up my arrows. Um, I think I've only got like one freaking arrow left. Oh, yeah, it looks like it's going to allow me to pick a couple of them up. That's good. I think I have four or five. So losing one, usually you can hear it crack or pop when you lose it. So losing one isn't bad, really, I guess. Just, you know, just to try it out. I've never actually done it before. Where's our snares? Okay, so we're gonna place we're gonna place one here and then I gotta go get the other one. The snares work really well. You don't have to worry about, you know, wasting any ammun oh that snare is broken. Is it? Was it broken? No, I don't think it was broken. Okay, where's our other one? There's our other one right there. So I'll place this one. They were pretty much walking in a line right here, I think. So I'm going to go ahead and place the other one right here. Whoops. And then I'm going to go back upstairs. I'm going to just eat, and I'm going to drink, and I'm going to cook the extra fish and stuff, and I'm just going to wait for another, for another night and um, see if we can get a couple more rabbits. So I'll be right back, guys. Okay, guys, we are back. I've went ahead and cooked as much of the meat as I can. I'm kind of out of firewood, and I'm kind of not going to... I'm thinking I'm not really going to get some more firewood because it's heavy, and we've got all this bloody meat right here. Bloody meat. And I forgot to drop the rabbit. And that was dumb of me, because now it's even more rotten, which, eh, not really a big deal. I tried, man. I hunted so hard with the bow and arrow, trying to get a rabbit, and I just could not get one. It looks like we only got one over the night, unfortunately. Uh, we really don't need the meat. We do need the hide. It's only 38 minutes to harvest. That's not a big deal. So it looks like I'm probably going to be staying yet another night up here doing this just just to get enough hides so we can so we can make a, uh, the rabbit skin gloves. I think we need 4. I'm pretty sure we need 4. So at the very least I'm going to get 4 and then I'm probably um 
I think I'm going to replace this one up here. I'm going to get four, and then instead of just getting five, I'm going to go ahead and just say enough's enough, and I'm just going to make the rabbit skin uh, gloves and not really worry about, you know, making a fifth one or getting a fifth rabbit just to repair before we go. I may do that a little bit later, but I'm kind of tired of being up here. It's been two days. Um, not really a lot of activity other than where did I have it last time? Come on. Like I said, I tried to do some some rabbit hunting with that bow, and that just wasn't working out at all. At all. There's a rabbit right Oh, See? And they just run as soon as you get to them. It just sucks, man. It's just like, it's like okay, you have to crouch all the way to them before you even see them half of the time. <clears throat> Excuse me. And that's just kind of a pain. And then when you do get close enough, you have to stand up because it won't allow you to pull the bow back unless you stand up, which is dumb because you can shoot the rifle. So let's try this guy right here. See that? He just takes off before... I mean, it's just... Uh, it's ridiculous. It's frustrating. I'm getting very frustrated. Very frustrated. Ugh! And I just want to get the rabbits done as quickly as I possibly can. We've got so much food that i got to take back. I mean, we're up to like 120 pounds. I'm trying to eat as much of it as I can before we go. But this just isn't working out at all. Well, I shouldn't say that. It's actually working out really, really well because we've gotten three of them so far. And that's actually pretty good. Um... We only need one more to actually go back and, and start to start to cure them, so we can make the uh, the gloves. Is that a wolf down there that's coming up to the island? There's actually been wolves on this island that I've seen before, so I'm very cautious. Uh, a lot of people come up here and they're like, "Oh yeah, there's no problem coming up there. Wolves don't come up here." Yeah, they do actually. They do come up here every now and then. So, I'm trying to be as careful as I can <laughs> while I'm up here. I just, uh, I'm frustrated with the bow hunting, but at the same time, I want to keep doing it until I get one, so I don't, I don't know, I don't know, I don't know what to do, I don't know if I should keep trying, maybe, maybe that's what I should do, let's climb up on this rock up here and just see if I can hit him from range, I found my fourth arrow, by the way, it was actually stuck in a tree, I didn't know they could do that, that's kind of cool, though. See, there's one right there. Okay, so I crouch, and then I get all the way up to him, and I have to stand up to shoot at him. And it's... The aiming on it is so bad that... Did he just walk... He just walked right through the freaking snare. That's dumb. Just because I barely... I put it out, or I reset it. That's really dumb. He just walked right through it. Where'd this guy go? Where'd he go? Frustrating little buggers. And I've shot I've shot so many arrows. I I can't hit him. Either I'm really bad with the bow and arrow, which is it was strange because Normally on most games I'm actually pretty decent with the bow and arrow, but on this one I just suck. And it's starting to get cold outside. And all you do is you just go back and forth on this island and they they randomly spawn around. They spawn on this side and then they spawn on the other side. So you just gotta go bouncing back and forth. You know what, let's try this one. He's stuck. Oh, it only took four hours, guys, and we finally got, with a bow and arrow, we got a rabbit. All right, that means we've got plenty of rabbit hides now. I'm going to harvest this, this one and call it and say that's enough and go the crap back to the Quonset. We're just, we're already heavy. I mean, I'm at 70 pounds and I don't even have all that meat on me. And that's because of the food and stuff that we were able to find in this house up here. It's actually a pretty decent cache. 
of food. So, unfortunately, there isn't a fireplace in there, so I've had to make the fires outside, which has sucked, I'll be honest with you. <laughs> so, I'm going to go in, I'm going to eat, I'm going to sleep a little bit until I'm rested to full, and then I'm going to grab all of this friggin' meat, this bloody meat, and I'm going to take back, or I'm going to take off back to the Quonset. And I think that's pretty much it. We're going to call it for today. This is an episode. Um, if you liked it, hit the like button. If you didn't like it, don't hit it. Make sure you subscribe. Thanks for coming out to the channel and hang out, guys. Thanks for all the support. Uh, keep gaming. Keep doing it at midnight. Keep having a blast. We'll see you guys in the next episode. Take care.